Hi our kids! We are going to be doing a little Shetland pony today. So for those of you who don't know horses, they're kind of, uh, they never get very big. They just, they stay kind of small, their legs are shorter, and their bodies are a little bulkier. So because there's so many parts to this, and I want to get my proportions right, I'm going to lay this out first with my pencil. You guys probably don't even see what I'm doing exactly because it's very light. There we go. Okay, so now I kind of have um, an idea of where things go. So now I'm going to start drawing it out with my black marker. Now, if I were you guys, I would draw it with pencil because then you can move it around. So, to start with, what I'm going to do is I'm going to come right here, kind of in the middle, maybe to the right just a little bit, and I'm gonna start by drawing the pony neck, just like that. So it's about two finger widths, all right? Then I'm gonna start up here, and I'm gonna go like that, and that's gonna be the pony's jaw. Then I'm gonna start kind of where, before the jaw ends and just come down and around like that. Okay, so now I'm gonna start, so that, this is his bottom um, jaw right here. So now I'm gonna come up here, this is his top jaw. I'm gonna come down and around like that. And there's his nose. Okay, so now I'm gonna put like kind of a letter C right there for his nose. And then his nose is gonna come up and it's gonna get bigger as it comes up, so it's coming up. Don't do parallel, do go up. All right, then I'm gonna draw his hair and his eye, okay. So Shetland ponies have lots of hair, and I think that's why they're so cute. So I'm just doing some letter M's, and then I'm gonna come around like so. All right, and then I'm gonna add one more little line there. Okay, now here's where you're gonna put an ear. we need to get his eye on so he can see the apples that people will feed him. Okay, so his hair is going in front of his eyes. So we're going to start up here and make a line coming across like that. Then we're going to make a big circle and we're going to fill the circle in except for part of it so it's got some light shining in it. And then we're going to come down and across like so. All right, you guys are doing a great job. Now, I'm gonna draw his mane. So, his mane is kind of fluffy and it comes back. Try not to draw super straight, okay? So my length between these things is about as thick as four fingers, maybe five on you if you, if you have, I have big hands. All right, then we're gonna just 
come back in here, make some hair, like that. All right, good job everybody. So now we're gonna make the body. So the body's gonna start a little bit further up the neck right here. And it's just gonna come down and around. Then we're gonna start another line that's gonna come straight across like so. All right, we're gonna have one leg that starts where those two lines meet. And it's gonna come down and back. crazy looking line. All right, now we're going to start up here more and we're going to come down and it's going to meet up with this knee right here and then it's going to come out and then it's going to come back with a little hook, a little giddy up there and then it's going to come around. And there's one leg. He's got short legs. He's a Shetland. All right, now we're gonna do another leg right here. Okay, so we're gonna come out just a ways. And we're gonna draw a line coming up right here first. Then we're gonna draw a line down. And another line down. Then we're gonna come out. There's his hoof. All right. Then we're gonna start right here. And we're gonna come down and then where his knee is we're going to come out and we're going to come down and hook it out and we're going to come around like this so this time there's his hoof okay so now we're going to draw his belly so his belly is just going to come around and then come back up like so Then we're gonna draw right here, we're gonna draw his, his little pony rear end. So it's gonna come up and around, and then it's gonna come around like that. So now we just have a tail and some rear, rear legs to put on. So his rear leg, if you start right here, it's just gonna come back in, then you're gonna come back on it and then come in a little bit back out like so okay so here's the knee part right here then you're gonna come over here to the tummy and this back part is gonna come in and then you're gonna come back even further with the knee come back out and there's the back leg then we have the back leg that's on the other side. So we're gonna come in just a little bit, come up a little bit, come back, kinda like we did on the colt. Around, back down. And you want this leg to be a little bit higher. Okay, so now we're gonna do the front part of the leg. So it's just gonna come down, have a little jut out. go he's got a big butt now I ran out of room for the for the tail so I think I think I'm gonna make his tail coming out here like that that's cute all right let's see what else could I do I could put some lines in here for his mane I could do that um, I think that looks pretty good. He looks nice. All right, I think I'm gonna put a line right here for where he is. Okay, and uh, I'll just color it. Looks really good. All right, if you enjoy drawing with me, please subscribe to Middle School Art Mania and become a maniac. All right, thanks for listening and drawing with me, artists.